Better repair this suit before it falls apart even more. Folks, you know I'm not one to promote conspiracy theories. Except ones I think are worthy of further discussion, like this one. I've heard reports of Spider-Man hovering around radio towers. At first, I thought he was sabotaging it. But a far more alarming possibility came to mind. In his misguided delusion that he is protecting us, is he hacking into all our conversations? Business deals, credit card transactions, those personal calls with the wife when you're on a long, lonely book tour. I mean, when one is on a book tour, I wasn't talking about myself. I don't do that sort of thing. And anyone who thinks they have recordings of me doing it is wrong. Looks like Doc's gone for the night. Time to sneak in some spider work. Interesting. Doc's hardwiring in a basic spatial mapping system. Cool. Arms will have a sense of their surroundings now. Should help with body awareness. Need to tune the arms gyro to auto-orient. Done. This will really help users maintain their equilibrium while wearing the prosthetic. Doc's trying to lower the overall power consumption of the prosthetic. Way more efficient. And probably safer, too. We really need to get better about organizing our workspace. The grant review was a debacle, yes. But it may also prove to be the inspiration I need. We can no longer simply meet the committee's expectations. We must exceed them. Hmm, what was Doc working on with this? Great conductivity. Not sure about long-term wear and tear, though. Might delaminate easily. Doc was testing the biocompatibility of graphene. Great. Pretty high cytotoxicity. Not sure I'd use this as tissue interface. Wonder if I could 3D print a web shooter. Can't believe I've never tried that. Graduation. It feels so long ago. I interned for Doc in college. He made me realize I could do as much good for the world in a lab coat as I could in tights. Maybe more. Doc's made huge breakthroughs his whole career, but he's always been upstaged. 
usually by Oscorp. This time, it's going to be different. Parker! Dr. Octavius! I, uh, uh... What you got there? Chinese. If I knew you'd be here, I would've... What are you working on? Oh, just a side project. Of course. It's you. I, uh, I, I don't know what oh, you're... Oh, come on, Parker. It's obvious. L -l let me explain. I only wish you'd told me sooner. I wanted to. But I was afraid that if word got out, my family might be in danger. Huh. Yes. Uh, I guess if you design his equipment, you're bound to be a target, too. Yeah. Um, yeah. Don't worry. Your secret's safe. Well, I'll leave you to it. Check your email. I hope this isn't how Doc fires me. Peter, the revelation of your second job as Spider-Man suit crafter, is that the right term? <clears throat> is a reminder of the good man and partner you are. No matter how hard you work, you still find time to help others. I hope you don't mind, but I noticed the suit was a bit damaged, and I took the liberty of sketching up some of my own improvements. Attached are a few ideas I had on how you could enhance his suit and help protect Spider-Man, who does so much for this city. Looking forward to the incredible work that we are doing and changing the world together. Your partner and friend, Otto. White Spider, huh? Hmm. Same old me. 